here with senior Luke Vigiano. Uh, Luke, tell us a little bit about the season. Um, I, we went 19-6, won the first uh, sectional championship in 15 years. Um, we had a great time together. We were tight, tightly knit team. Um, good chemistry, and we snapped off a 14-game win streak, I believe, towards the end of the year. It was a lot of fun. But it looked like you guys had several seasons. First game against Casanova, I think uh, Craig and somebody else no hit them. You win, win 10 to one. A um, couple of uh, rough games against Grimes or. Yeah, I think Grimes and, and, and CBA, and uh, you guys pull it together with a close win, 97 over Central Square, and then call that first season, finished two and two, but then you guys went to South Carolina, won three out of four games. The game you lost was a, was a heartbreaker, probably should have had that one, but you guys really kicked it into gear after that, after a couple of uh, rough games, I think against Wheatsport. I can't remember the other one, but then kick off that nine game winning streak, which propelled you all, all the way through. You know, what do you attribute to that uh, strong finish? Um, I mean, we knew the second half of our schedule was a bit on the easier side rather than the first half, but um, I mean, our bats got especially hot. Everyone, everyone was hitting the ball. Um, our, we're cutting down on the airs, and we're just playing better baseball as a team. Well, I talked to a, a lot of the parents and a lot of the guys, and I would know that there was one point in time in the season when you were red hot. I think uh, Mr. Muso told me that you couldn't get him out if you wanted to. So uh, what was going through your head at that time? Just swing the bat? And, <laughs> yeah. Uh, um, I was just very aggressive at the play. Um, like my first 49 at-bats, I didn't have a walk. Um, so I was just swinging it a lot. I was having short, short at bats, but um, I was putting the ball in play, and and I was beating out a lot of infield hits, ground balls. <laughs> Why are these guys laughing so hard? Because they make fun of me for my infield hits. Right. And they had ten more hits than probably everyone over there. <laughs> so, uh, I think I think the statistics will back that up. So uh, it's interesting that you're getting on these guys. You know, I watched you play a lot of football as well. All CNY cornerback, correct? Mm -hmm. Your senior year, which is which is which is great. You have a little bit of a reputation as being an agitator. Yep. Is that fair? Yeah, that's accurate. Right. Can you describe that a little bit? What are you trying to do? Um, I don't know. I just like to mess around, and sometimes I mess around too much, I guess, and it gets under those guys' skins. But I mean, uh, it makes people work harder, I think. So, especially in football, when I get under people like Muso skins, the younger kids, sure. it's even easier. But um, you know, it's, it's lots of fun to poke around. I do it with Jimmy a lot, Craig. Yeah. All right. Well, what's the future hold for you? I'm going to Siena College. Oh, great school. Probably to major in business. Major in business. Mm -hmm. Still play yeah. baseball? Yeah, I'll probably try out for the club team. All right. What about football? They don't have a football team or anything over there. But hey, maybe I'll look into rugby. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. You know, so one thing we got to talk about with, with you is uh, these guys are making fun of you, but I know in the playoff game against Camden, you came up with a big hit, and that definitely um, left the infield. So why don't you talk a little <laughs> bit about that? Um, about in the eighth, uh, Nate Wellington was on second. I think there was one out. Um, they, they had a lefty going. He was pounding the zone the whole entire game. He had one walk. Uh, probably the best pitcher we've seen up to date. Um, he's throwing a good curveball. So he's throwing a lot of first pitch fastballs, and he got up, he threw me first pitch fastball, and I hit up the middle, and that was it. All right, well, so that was uh, the second consecutive game that you guys won, one and nothing in the bottom of the last inning. Mm -hmm. Previous game against Marcel, one and nothing in the, the bottom of the seventh, this one in the, in the bottom of the eighth, and uh, carried you all the way through. I wrote an article at some point in time calling you guys the cardiac kids, yeah. and uh, definitely seemed to be the case. Well. Congratulations on the great season, and we look forward to following you in the future. All right, thank you. Thanks.